Alright, what's good y'all? Today we are going to do some healthy shit. So it's good for if you're working out or whatever. If you got kids that don't want to eat broccoli, it's going to be good for all the same things. So in here I got some frozen broccoli I just got. It's trying to melt. Well, not melt, but uh, defrost and all that kind of shit. And right here I got some chicken. Uh, particularly thighs you use breasts or whatever you want to use. It's your motherfucking shit. So I'm going to just show y'all what we're doing today. I got some of this Oktoberfest chicken uh, spice rub. Y'all seen it before? But I don't know if y'all can get it where y'all at. But if y'all can, cool. If not, use whatever you got. Drop it off. A little bit of this motherfucking shit. In the bitch. Goddamn black pepper. It's going in there too. Just like that. Toss that motherfucking shit around. Toss it up. All you're doing is trying to get the chicken all cooked till it go in the shit. Ooh, and look at the nice colors. Now, if you ain't got this, this Oktoberfest stuff that I got, you use, well, firstly, you can use whatever you got a taste for, but I would say use, okay, some paprika, so that way you can turn nice, or like a ready orange or whatever. Uh, use some lemon pepper. Use some garlic salt. Damn, I probably should have put that in there instead of this large. But it don't matter. It, it, it's, it's the same thing. You just want the chicken to be good, so it, 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 uh, it cook good and it look good. Um, and then use... Uh, a little bit of crushed red pepper or some cayenne pepper. Either one will work, but not a whole lot, just a little bit. All right, I got my goddamn rice. We're gonna put this down in here. This is ain't nothing but some jasmine rice that I cooked in the, the cooker. It's been sitting in there for a minute. That's why it came, oh shit, came out just like that. But you ain't gotta use jasmine rice. You can use brown rice or whatever you wanna use. If you use brown rice, um, that's healthier. So you do it how you wanna do it. All right, so we're gonna do this, we're gonna do this right. And don't worry about what's going on in the background of my house. I got a lot of shit going on with school. So y'all just don't worry about that butter like a motherfucker. It kind of just fell in there. I was going to scoop it, but y'all saw that. Turn your chicken over a little bit because it's almost ready. God, motherfuck. Look at that shit. So you got to learn how to cook two things at one time. Don't be sitting there. You can't do one thing at a time. I mean, if you got to do it like that, then you do it like that. As long as it works for you, but motherfuckers ain't always got time, so you got to do it like this. Meanwhile, the chicken's done cooking. We're done stirring our uh, rock... Uh, rock. Rice, broccoli, and butter, and olive oil up in here, okay? So this is kind of what it's going to look like. I'm going to have to switch pots because y'all can see. Hold on. Garlic powder. Just a little bit. You don't want a whole lot because you don't want nobody's breath to be stinking like a motherfucker. Trust that. Parsley flakes. Down on the bitch. You use a lot of that shit because you want it to look good. Low sodium salt accent because we don't want heart attacks on it. We're trying to, you know, preserve our blood pressure and all that shit. Down in the bitch. Mix everything up. Get everybody acquainted with one another. All right, we got the motherfucking chicken. It's going in there, too. I had to switch sides so that way y'all can see it a little bit better. I know y'all probably still can't see because it's a little punk-ass little telescope I got. You want the seasoning and everything out the bottom of the, uh, the skillet, too, that's got cooked up in there. Because ain't juice and everything. All the oil. Because it's good. Stir it up. Get everybody, everybody acquainted. Everybody find a dance partner. That's what that's what they doing. And look at it. It look good, but we are missing something because we want it to be fun. We said it's for the kids too, right? Goddamn cheese. It's going in there too. Now you want to start out with a little bit because you gotta melt this shit. You don't want to put too much in there at one time. If you do that, it's gonna be hard. To, uh, it ain't gonna act right and everything. So you start off with something like that. And again, add whatever kind of cheese you want to use as long as it's cheddar cheese or cheddar jack or whatever because that's what this is. I did put a little bit more olive oil in here too, just because I felt like you needed it. But look at this. Man, the kids gonna love this. They got, cause they got cheese broccoli, because kids don't always like broccoli by itself. And shit, a lot of grown-ups don't even like uh, broccoli by itself, but I like broccoli by itself. I eat it, but you know, get everything acquainted. You got everybody You got everybody here at this party, and ain't nothing happened yet, so let's just see. Once you get all that turned over, look at it and see if you need more cheese. There it is. Your cheesy, motherfucking, healthy... Right? I'm gonna taste this bitch, because I know a lot of people want to see me taste it. Oh, no, this is excellent. Next time I'm gonna do it with some queso, I bet that'd even be even better.